Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so we're starting a new series. I talked about it in a few uh, previous videos, and today I decided today was a good day to start this series because. I have a few things to talk about. <laughs> in my past videos, you know I was talking about doing a series on pet peeves and I'm going to do these, I'm going to try to do these once a month. I don't want to do them more than once a month because I don't want a ton of negativity on my channel, um, but I do feel the need to um, express some opinions of mine. Um, so I'm going to try to do this once a month. If I don't get it up once a month, once every couple months, I just don't want to like spam you with negativity because you know, nobody wants to see that. But I feel like some people maybe share, um, some of the same feelings that I do. And if they don't, then you know, you don't have to watch it. First installment, um, is gonna be a short one hopefully hopefully I won't ramble on too long if you've seen my Grammy video that I did um you know music is one of those things that you know mostly you know it mostly brings people together because a lot of people just enjoy music and you know it's just it speaks to people in a way that you know other things just don't um so with that being said there are a couple of um, artists that I will speak of kind of indirectly, but this is, what, this is what kind of made me want to do this video. And it is um, just people downright hating other people. Um, the thing with that is, and you know, it's, it's, it's across all spectrums, not just music, but you know, the Grammys kind of triggered this um, this thought bubble in my head. So I will refer to that and kind of keep it there. But it does, you know, span, you know, different things and different uh, people and everything. So I'm just going to keep it kind of um, centered. And if you have any other opinions about anything, just leave, you know, comments down below and we can have a discussion. A friendly discussion. Um, but nonetheless, a discussion. <laughs> if it gets too negative, then I'm gonna have to, you know, cut that off. But I'm hoping this, you know, garners, you know, just, you know, a little bit of a discussion. You know, if you don't like what I'm talking about, then you don't have to leave a comment. And you sure don't have to watch. So, you know, keep the hate to a minimum on these videos, please. Thank you. So, if you are interested in hearing what I have to say, because... Let's face it, it's my opinion, and it will always be my opinion. If you have a different opinion, that's fine. You know, we can agree to disagree and call it a day. So if you want to hear what I have to say, just keep watching. Today we are going to talk about people that hate other people. Okay, and I'm talking not like just dislike. I'm talking downright just, I can't stand that person, I don't care what they do. Kind of hate. Okay. Now, like I said, it, this is stemming from me watching the Grammys and me seeing other people's opinions and statements and, you know, stuff like that. So, we're going to keep it kind of centered there so I don't ramble on for an hour. Um, case in point is the Lady Gaga performance, or tribute, mind you, uh, for David Bowie. Now... You can either like Lady Gaga or not like her, okay? But here's the thing. She put on a really good performance. But some people are so um, centered and concentrated on how much they don't like her that they're not going to give her credit no matter what. Now, like I said, you can love her or hate her, but you've got to give the girl credit. She can put on a show. She knows how to sing. She's talented, okay? She's crazy. I understand. She's crazy. But she has toned down a little bit. It's David Bowie. Anybody that knows David Bowie knows that he was very eccentric. He was very out there. So d d Lady Gaga was the perfect person to put this on. Okay? You know, it's like I said, lover or hater, you know damn well she put a damn show on. And she did it well. Okay? So for those of people that 
feel the need to just hate on people for no reason. This video is for you. <laughs> I cannot stand with the, every part of my being people that will just not give other people credit just because they don't like them. Okay? And that goes for everybody. That doesn't just go for artists, musicians, actors, whatever. You know, I'm not a fan. I'm not a huge fan. I am a fan. I'm not a huge out there fan of Leonardo DiCaprio. But you know what? He puts out some good crap. <laughs> good crap. <laughs> I'm calling his stuff crap. I didn't mean to use that. He puts out some really, really good uh, content. Good movies. There are very, there are quite a few movies that I've actually enjoyed watching him in. Titanic, Romeo and Juliet, The Wolf of Wall Street. I mean, it, as vulgar as that movie was, it was a good movie. It was a long movie, but it was a good movie. Um, and, you know, I sat through the, Rev or I tried to sit through The Revenant, and I just, I can't. I, I'm not a movie person, so I have to be really into a movie to enjoy a movie. So, The Revenant just was not one of those movies. Now, will he win the Oscar for it? We'll see. I hope he does, because he, he is more than deserving of an Oscar. He should have won an Oscar a long time ago. But that's, you know, neither here nor there either. Another thing. Let's go back to the music. Taylor Swift. Okay? You can love her or you can hate her. But you've got to give the girl credit where it's due. She's a good artist. Can she? She's not the perfect singer. She's not perfect. Nobody is. But the girl does her thing. Okay, I've actually attended one of her concerts when she first came on the scene. Okay, the girl puts on a show for the fans. She herself is a fan. I mean, if you've watched any award shows, you know how she is when she's there. I mean, when she's not there, obviously, you don't see her. But, I mean, they're always panning to her. They're always showing her dancing and getting excited. And, I mean, she is a fan. Okay, she is more of a fan than an artist. So she knows what people like. So she tries to do her best in putting out content that people will like. Okay, so because she knows as a fan what people enjoy. So, you either love her or hate her. But you need to at least give her credit where credit is due. I don't care if you hate her. But don't be a hater. You don't have to put your hate out there for everybody. If you don't like her, move on. You don't have to watch what she does. But you don't have to be outright mean either. And that goes for Taylor. That goes for Lady Gaga. That goes for anything. Country music. Okay? Oh, it's not country anymore. Okay, that's fine. That's your opinion. But you don't need to constantly be like, oh, you know, they wear those skinny jeans and they do this and they do this. I mean, who cares? It's what people like. Okay? If people didn't like it, people wouldn't buy it. People wouldn't go see it. People wouldn't watch it. Okay? Therefore, it wouldn't be popular. Now, if you want to go and say it's not real country, that's fine. But what can you really define as real country? The stuff that Hank Williams does or did or George Jones or Alan Jackson or, I don't know, I, I can name a ton of people, okay? Uh, the, the new music has evolved. It's more poppy. It's more rocky. It's more just there. That's what people like. So they're going to continue putting out stuff that people like. If you don't like that, you don't have to constantly be negative about it. That's just how it goes. If you don't like it, change the channel. You don't like it, don't watch it. Don't listen to it. Don't talk about it. Because the more you talk about it, the more you're putting it out there, and then the more popular it is. So, you're not doing it justice if you don't like it. If you don't like it, don't give it any attention. Just be done. Okay? A lot of people don't like certain people. I, for one, 
am a fan of a lot of people. But you know what? I also am not a fan of a lot of people. But I don't sit on Facebook saying, oh my God, I can't believe they allow him to do this and this and this and this. That goes hand in hand with everything. Okay? Not just music. Not just movies. That goes into the political realm. The religious realm. Or anything that people have feel the need to hate on. Okay? Just just be quiet. It's okay to share your opinion on things. If it's done properly, if it's done in a way that you're not being just downright mean, people need to understand that they have to have a little bit of respect no matter what. Okay? People will like things. People will hate things. But when it comes down to it, if you don't like it, you don't have to be mean about it, okay? Just move on, okay? And let people listen to, watch, follow, whatever, what they like. You don't have to be mean. There, there's nothing there. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. You don't have to be mean about it. That's all I'm saying, okay? If I don't agree with you, I'm going to keep my mouth shut, okay? I like Luke Bryan, okay? I like him. I didn't like him at first, but you know what? I went to one of his concerts. I was like, okay, I like this dude. And you know what? And I started listening to him. And then I went to another concert. And then I was like this close to him at the last concert I was at. All right, cool. I liked him even more. I'm going to another concert next month. I like Luke Bryan. I like the newer country. I don't like all of the newer country. I like some of the newer country. But the thing is, is that people are always talking about berating other people, but yet you're doing it by saying, oh, well, he, you know, he's not real country. He's a girly man. He, you know, he, he has a vagina. No, what? No. He's a singer. D do you like him? Okay, that's fine. You don't. That's fine. I do. But I'm not going to sit here and argue with you over why you hate him. Because you know what? I'm not going to change your opinion of it. So I'm not going to waste my time. I'm going to continue to listen to him. I'm going to continue to support him. I'm going to continue to go to his concerts. And I'm going to leave you alone. Because there is no change in your opinion. That's all I'm saying. If you're going to be hateful, you just need to be off of social media. There's no sense in it. Because all that is is causing more drama. And I hate drama. I cannot stand unnecessary drama. Okay? can't stand it. So just be nice. There's nothing wrong with being nice. Being nice costs you nothing. Okay? Just be nice. End of story. If you hate something, let it go. If you like something, that's fine. But don't hate on people for liking something you don't like. Or don't hate on something that you know was good. But just because you don't like that person you're going to hate it. You know? I mean, that's just... It's unnecessary. So, with that being said, this is my first edition of my Pet Peeve series. <laughs> if you have any opinions on what I had, had to say, leave a comment down below. I would love to have a, uh, a educated and um, simple, polite agreement or disagreement with you. We can agree to disagree, people. We can agree to disagree. It would make the world a lot simpler to live in. <laughs> so, until next time, guys, I'll see you later. Bye.